Eight-year-old Harry Hauser was out on DeRider Lake last Thursday with his cousin Matthew Williams when they noticed something was wrong with a fishing boat. Well, we thought that somebody was in the boat earlier, and then we kind of got a little freaked out. The two cousins were concerned, and when they drove over, they realized the boat was overturned. And then we saw hands, like, right by the motor. 63-year-old Kevin McAvoy of Cortland had fallen out of the boat when a loose seat moved as he stood on it to cast his fishing line. The boat flipped when McAvoy tried to climb back in. He had a life jacket and was debating swimming 100 to 200 yards to shore when the boys pulled up. But the kids, they, they pretty much reacted uh, really well for me and uh, went straight on over and got the pontoon boat, so the swimming option didn't have to happen. The boys' boat was too small for McAvoy, so they went back to shore for help. Matthew's father and grandfather brought a pontoon boat out, and Harry's 11-year-old sister, Helen, helped McAvoy climb aboard. I was worried about because I could see all the things that were coming out of the boat and just sinking down. The family then went out to tow McAvoy's boat back to the dock, and the next day, they used snorkels to recover his tackle box. McAvoy and the parents thanked the kids for being sharp-eyed. I just, I'm incredibly proud that they remained very calm and they just kept their wits about them. And they say they will always remember when this family vacation turned into a rescue. Yeah. Yeah, when my teacher asked me what I did this summer, I'll say, I saved a guy. <laughs> Kevin McAvoy took all the kids out for ice cream that night and sent them a card calling them his heroes. For now, reporting from DeRider Lake, I'm Alex Dunbar.